hello guys welcome to my channel today we are going to see how to fix the issue with valorant you got the error the following compounds are required to run this program directx runtime error let's fix it guys you just need to right click on the start icon and select settings select windows update on left side select check for updates if you have any available updates listed over here then you just need to update it guys and make your operating system up to date after doing this close it off here right click on the start icon and select device manager expand the display adapter section right click on the graphics card you are using it and select properties select a driver tab if rollback option is available click on the option rollback driver because the latest driver may conflicts with the game and it gives you the DirectX runtime error. If this solution failed to work, then let's move on to the second solution, guys. You just need to close out of here. Now you just need to right click on the start icon and select run. In run window, you just need to type a percentage program data percentage again. Click on OK. Now in here, if you have any folders with the name of Valorant or right client you just need to go ahead and delete it guys right click on the right client and delete it after deleting it you just need to close it off here right click on the start icon and select run in run window you just need to type percentage local update the percentage again click on ok again delete the both folder with the name Valorant and right games in here you just need to search for it valorant and write games you just need to right click on it and select delete it guys after deleting this both folders you just need to close it off here and now you just need to check my video description for this link used in my video you just need to scroll down and select the download option and download it after downloading the valorant installer you just need to go ahead and run it and after running it check if the problem solved or not if not let's move on to the third solution guys generally the issue proceeds because of a file with the name of x3d audio 1-7.dll so you need to download this dll file you just need to scroll down and select the download option and download it after getting download done you just need to select show in folders and you just need to right click on the zip file and select extract all and extract it after extracting this folder you just need to copy this dll file and after copying the dll file you just need to go to this pc local disk c and double click on the windows folder now you just need to search for system 32 bit folder you just need to double click on it and now paste in here guys select replace the file in the destination select continue after doing this go back to windows and now you just need to search for sys wow 64 folder you just need to double click on it and now paste in here as well select replace the file in the destination select continue after doing this you just need to close it off here and go ahead and restart your pc guys after restarting your pc check if the problem solved or not if not let's move on to the final solution guys the directx runtime error is because the oldest directx runtime files are not present in the valorant game check my video description for this link used in my video i just need to scroll down and download the latest directx guys after getting download done you just need to click on it and install it guys after getting installed done, hopefully your issue has been resolved guys if all these solution fails to work i have a simple solution guys if you have installed a commando antivirus in your system you just need to go ahead and disable it guys because it is blocking the valorant files and gives you the directx runtime error I hope one of these solutions fixed your problem guys. If the video helped you, don't forget to leave a like guys. You can also subscribe me and support me guys. Thank you.